a lot of people have been asking why did, did we take the video down. It's because the video was taken out of context. And I'm tired of getting all of my African brothers and sisters, those who are being haters, I'm tired of you guys in my inbox hating on me for something that you are taking out of context. So this video here was responding to this brother here comparing Nairobi uh, to a Ferrari. All of my videos are positive, but I look forward to seeing uh, your comments. Y'all don't understand. Nairobi, to y'all, because y'all can't leave the country, or you only have a few countries you can go to, we've traveled around a good portion of the earth. And Nairobi is a 1992 Toyota compared to the rest of the civilized world. We're not expecting Kenya to conform to our standards. We expect that Kenyan, black Kenyan people should be elevated to the standard they deserve. Nairobi, now it may be the best place in Kenya, is, is a third world anywhere else. And either I'm telling the truth, no, no, no cap, I'm not uh, disrespecting, but it's the truth. Nairobi is, it's a, I've been scammed there. It's a lot of black people who want to pretend like they well to do. You want to imitate white people. Why? How do you imitate white people? Because you go around scamming, stealing, just like white people do. White people come here and scam and steal. That's where you learn it from. But now y'all come tell us, well, you should go to Nairobi. No, we want, we want to get away from that kind of environment. We want to be in a place where it's calm and peaceful. Not in a place where every black person is imitating, trying their best to imitate a white person. Most of the people here believe in a, in, in a white God or an Arab God. We're not, we're not here for that. What we're here to do is, is to encourage other black people to raise your standards up. That's what we do. We raising our standards up. Even in the fact that we're, where we, we've come here, our, raising our standards here compared to America. In America, they got, they about to have flying cars. If we wanted to go somewhere nice, we just would have stayed in America. And America's not nothing nice. Most of y'all haven't been there, so you don't know. All you see is on television. If we wanted to stay in America, we want to, we want to leave America. Why? Because it's a horrible place, especially if you have color in your skin. Now y'all call us Mazungus, y'all wanna say whatever you want, blah, blah, blah. You don't understand what white supremacy is. How it, what it is and how it works. You don't have a, a clue because you love white people too much. We wanted to stay in America, we just would've stayed there. Then we could be, we could walk down the sidewalks there. We could drink the dirty water there. They got running water in every house, but it's still dirty and not clean. We can go walk down the street uh, and, and drive fancy cars and, and go get a job. That's what y'all trying to do in America. Here in Nairobi, it, it uh, Nairobi is is modern if you come in the Kwale. In Kwale County, yeah, Nairobi compared to Kwale, Nairobi, yes. But you go from Nairobi to, let's say, South Africa. You go down to Durban, you go down to Johannesburg, that's a, that's a second world country. You will see the standard of, of the quality of living, just the, the basics, sidewalks, running water. You know, there's a, there's a standard of living and we would encourage that the, the all Africans who have melanin, black people who are being oppressed by white people, would, would achieve to have the, the basic standards. Once again, running water, uh, housing, infrastructure, things like this. This is a developing, uh, these are developing, quote unquote, developing countries. Now, why are they not developed? Because white people come over here and make sure that you stay in the position that you at. So don't come looking at us. Oh man, you should go here. We didn't come here to, to go try to be like white people. That's what y'all do. Y'all live here and try to attain whiteness in your black skin. While you have synthetic wigs and bleaching your skin. Take off the synthetic wigs from, uh, you get all your wigs from China. Trying to look white with straight hair. You put on a synthetic flammable wig. Anybody walk past you with a cigarette, <clears throat> Catch on fire like Michael Jackson, y'all probably don't know about that. But you need to uh, quit trying to achieve whiteness. 
and, and achieve black excellence. Understand who your enemy is. 